Yeah, so what I did was I upgraded to the beta driver version, NVIDIA's beta driver uh, 290.36, and that seemed to have fixed the graphical hang-ups. And then uh, to make sure that my CPU is getting cooled down enough, um, I actually have a uh, manual control over the CPU fan, and I just set it to the max setting so that it stays nice and cool so um, uh, I figured I'd let you see that um, here's the uh, thing again the uh, video card one more time so you can see that now the lighting's kinda sad <laughs> but uh, I really can't afford one of those super duper cameras that does everything <laughs> um, yeah, my driving kind of sucked, but eh, it's still a fun game. And um, let's see here, I'm going to put this back. I was using something to stand the camera up. And now I'm moving that stuff out of the way. It's a real pain in the butt to like video camera, like you're driving, like from the passenger seat. It's like side seat driver, like people say. Well, that's what this is like <laughs> with this camera. <laughs> yeah, so now you can see uh, you can see what RPMs my CPU is running at, uh, the fan is running at, and the temperature. This is a really cool little program. I'm glad that uh, somebody made it. So I'm going to put it back on smart mode, and that's where things go wrong sometimes because it uh, it doesn't kick up the fan speed fast enough. So it kind of like clocks back and then um, you you experience that in the game but I think most of the most of the problems like I, if you saw one of my previous videos I was using the official NVIDIA latest NVIDIA driver version actually I can go over to NVIDIA's website and show you that what their official one was and I was having problems um, with that 
with uh, Need for Speed the Run. Let me see if I can get there, NVIDIA. Yeah. So I'm gonna go to NVIDIA's drivers. I've got a GeForce uh, 460 um, GTX. Well, actually it's a Razer one, so um, I've had that for a while now. But let me show you the driver version that I had uh, problems with for Need for Speed to Run. And the beta driver seems to have fixed that. So this is the driver version I was running before. Um, I know this because I just changed this today. And uh, this was the newest one available when I, when I did the auto search. Um, so um, when I updated to the beta driver, let me show you that one. Um, that seemed to have fixed my all pr pretty much all my Need for Speed run for run and problems, including well, I had to do the CPU fan thing because, um, like I said, the fan isn't kicking up fast enough. I don't think. Um, but between having the beta driver and the CPU fan fix, uh, it seems to be fine again. I think I had a previous NVIDIA driver that would actually perform better than the official one that's out now. And I, I guess I updated because the origin thing was crashing on me. Like the, I guess the overlay was, wasn't working properly. So I upgraded the driver and I thought, well, that fixed, that, that fixed the overlay issue. But I guess it created a graphical lag, which I wasn't aware of. So I don't, it's kind of a, yeah, it's kind of a pain in the ass, but oh well. So, I figured I'd post one follow-up video. I don't, there's something I wanted to say, I think, but uh, I might as well just, like, end this video now. Oh, let's see. Oh, my processor. Yeah, I bet you that shows up on here. Wait a second, let's see if I can find it. Oh, it says the bus is a PCI Express 1X bus. So that's what I've got going on there. Um... I wonder if it shows my processor anywhere. I think. Uh, let's see. Oh, I know how to see my processor. That I got the official way of seeing my processor. So I figured I'm running tight on time. Got to get this up so I can end the video real fast so that I don't go over my allocation of time. <laughs> I got 15 seconds for this thing to pop up so I can show you which processor I'm using. Ah, so yeah, it's the i7-620M, yay, and it's, uh, right now it's saying that uh, we're running at 3.0 gigahertz, so I'm going to end this video now, and I just went a few seconds over, so hopefully I can trim this up a bit. See ya.